Hey guys, Steve from Performance Institute here, just talking about fillers, and again, if you haven't seen the other videos yet, fillers are exercises, activation drills, stretches, mobility drills, things that we can do to help uh, make movement more efficient. Um, and then often what we'll do is when we assess our clients, we'll find inefficiencies, and again, use these fillers as a way to help improve their movement quality, help them feel better. Uh, an example I had with a client doing a goblet squat the other day, was, so he's holding, he was holding a dumbbell actually, um, was doing a goblet squat and as he lowered down, again, the weight wasn't too heavy for him, but he was just having a hard time finding his position. So he was squatting and he was tending to round the upper back. And I was trying to coach him through it, helped a little bit, but it wasn't perfect and it wasn't quite where I wanted him. So I tried another filler. So we tried a little stretch just to help open up his chest, his lats, all these internal rotators of the shoulder that tend to get us to round forward. And again, something that happens to us as we tend to sit um, a lot at our work, which a lot of us are doing. Um, so you could use a barbell if you have a rack, you could use a wall, or if you have a, some suspension handles, what you're gonna do is step back, keep a soft bend in the knees, try to keep your arms straight, and just reach back the hips, and think about trying to sink your chest down towards the floor. Hold that for three to five seconds. Just come up out of it. Again, make sure your shoulders are staying down in a good position. Lean forward. Again, hold that three to five seconds. Try that for about 10 to 12 reps. Stand up out of it and just see how you feel. The difference that I saw was quite remarkable. And again, it was just helping to create that better position so he could go back to the goblet squat with very good form. So again, that's another good filler you can try out. Great little stretch to help with posture. This is a stretch I'm really becoming more and more fond of as I do it. So again, you don't need a suspension. You could use uh, just leaning against a wall or use a barbell, a uh, shelf, a table, something like that. You can try that as well. Just bend your knees more if it's lower. But hopefully that helps. Uh, keep your posture well. Talk to you soon, guys.